In this video, we're going to be looking at ICP price update. Internet computer is currently trading at around $11.87. We have 9 hours, 28 minutes for this daily candle to close. Uh, we are going to be talking about this overall cryptocurrency market cap. We are going to be talking about this BTC price update, what we should expect after they have in. And um, the market is already bleeding. A lot of people are panicking already. We're going to be talking about this BTC dominance chart as well as this uh, ICP liquidation heat map in order to get a clear picture of what we should expect. By the way, let's begin with the ICP liquidation heat map. Now it's kind of tricky. If you're looking at the um, liquidation heat map right now, you will notice we have a lot of liquidity between the zone of um, $12.33 and also $12.65. That is, there's a lot of liquidity around that zone. And we also have liquidity below it around eleven dollar forty one cent and also yeah between yeah between eleven dollar forty one cent and eleven dollar twenty six cent that area we have a lot of liquidity in that zone we have three hundred and thirty seven thousand dollar worth of liquidity to be taken out in the liquidation zone for icp around eleven dollar twenty six cent likewise to um we have um over ninety five over two hundred and seven something seven seven thousand dollars to be taken out the liquidity is both present in the upside and in the downside but let's just look at the charts in order to get a clear picture of what we should expect now this is the icp chart on the daily time frame and uh, we are currently trading at around eleven dollar eighty five cent now if the price of icp should dip to this demand zone the better like if you ask me in my own opinion the more we get into this zone is going to be much more better for we to get a massive bounce to the upside for icp price so we need to see icp dip a little bit further into this it's still around that zone though a little bit into the zone around 11 dollar 16 cent like i think i'll be setting my limit order at around 11 dollar 46 cent now pay attention remember we saw this liquidation zone in the liquidity heat map let's just confirm it in the liquidity heat, heat map real quick now eleven dollar forty something zone appeared in the liquidity heat map eleven dollar forty one zone okay thirty nine zone technically you understand so anything around that zone is a high probability zone we have over three hundred thousand dollar worth of liquidity to be taken out worth of liquidation position are waiting to be wiped out there now if you're paying attention to the chart you would notice that zone is the zone i'm going to set my limit order and if you want to go around here you can even set your long limit order now at the current price which is around 11 dollar 85 cent but the more we drop to take out those liquidity there to take to liquidate orders there the better and the potential price target is likely to be I think one of the potential price target is likely to be this week right here which is around thirteen dollar ninety seven cent another price target is sixteen dollar thirty five cent seventeen dollar fifty six cent and also twenty dollar ninety six cent respectively these are price targets you should keep on your radar please and please pay attention if you can go long from the current price fine it's okay but if you still want it to drop a little bit to the zone between the zone between eleven dollar forty three cent and also ten dollar sixty nine cent, then fine, you can set your limit order there, your long limit order, because historically that zone has proven herself to be a buy zone. Each time we drop to that zone, we usually get a massive price push. We drop to that zone here, we got a massive pump to the upside. Same thing happened here, we got a massive pump. Same thing happened here, we got massive pump to the upside. Same thing happened here, we got a massive pump to the upside. And it, I think it is repeating itself now. ICP is giving you another entry opportunity. Now, this price target I gave is the short-term price target. In the long run, ICP can get to $100, even $200, respectively. You just have to be a smart investor. Know when to sell, know when to exit, know when to take profit. Don't get greedy, please. Now, if you're looking at, let us check um, the BTC dominance chart. This is the BTC dominance chart 
on the weekly time frame by the way the higher the greater our drop the greater the btc dominance drop the better for our altcoin that is to say if we start seeing massive price correction in the btc dominance the btc dominance is different from the btc price you have to pay attention the btc dominant the, the moment we start seeing a massive correction in the btc dominant that is an indication that we are approaching all season and by the time the money starts rotating from bitcoin what is the money likely to rotate into it's going to rotate into the top 100 cryptocurrencies available in the space first before moving to the lower um smaller uh, market cap um cryptos if you're paying attention to icp you will notice we are ranked number 20th position out of over active over 9,000 active cryptocurrencies listed on coin market cap so the moment the liquidity started flowing from bitcoin the moment we started getting a rotation of liquidity flow from bitcoin then it's going to definitely drop into icp and by that time you are likely to begin to see market cap as high as 20 billion 30 billion dollar market cap if we are entering the all market cap you will notice we have previously crossed 40 billion dollar market cap for icp in 2022 so 40 billion dollar is still in the picture it can still happen let's look at the overall cryptocurrency market sentiment real quick by the way the overall cryptocurrency volume is down minus 40 percent in the last 24 hours not just icp icp volume is down minus 41 percent in the last 24 hours the overall market is kind of um stable and bleeding let's just check the um, overall cryptocurrency market sentiment real quick we are currently at 56 percent we closed yesterday with 53 percent and um I think we are kind of recovering but let's see how today is going to close with yes last week we closed last week with 69 percent last month with extreme grade which is 79 percent the truth of the matter is the market pump is going to come back very very soon you have to hold your position the moment we start seeing the btc dominance drop to 47 percent zone drop to 42 percent zone just know we are already in old season the greater the drop the better for our altcoin bags now if you are paying attention if you are paying attention to the btc price after they having the the usual post having price you will notice the first having that happened in 2012 we got a massive eight over eight thousand percent pump after the having in 2016 we got over 2700 percent pump after the having post having pump now in 20 uh 20 the post having pump we got we got was over 580 percent now 2024 is not going to be an exception 2024 post having pump is coming it hasn't even started so even if we're getting a hundred percent pump for btc or 200 percent pump the price is going to be massive we can see very soon we can see btc going as high as 100k 150k even 200k is still very possible considering the adoption rate in the overall crypto space so yeah that's that for that fingers crossed let's wait and see what icp will do my name is isaac once again please if you haven't liked this video like the video subscribe to my channel if you haven't already peace out